As for Ibn Taymiyyah's claim, then this is something which is easily established that what he's saying is not true. For we find that we've already mentioned some of the famous hadith books, Mustadrak. We have Tabarani in his Mu'jam al-Kabir narrating it. We have Ibn Abi Asim in his Ahad wal Muthanna narrating it. We have Ibn Asakir in his Tarikh Madinat Damashq narrating it. We have Abu Ya'la al mawsili in his Mu'jam narrating it. And of course, when we have Mustadrak, Mu'jam al Tabarani, Al Ahad wal Muthanni, and all these other books, then we see that it definitely has been narrated. So at least part of Ibn Taymiyyah's claim is untrue. Now, of course, we do have to appreciate that these people were writing in a time when they didn't have access to all the available books. That could very, very well be the case. And generally, you'll find such claims made in the books of all sects where they radically just deny something outright. But sadly, when it's done by the Shia sect, it's considered to be a natural act of lying. So I don't want to comment too much on that.